Well, hello, everyone. I'm so excited. I'm here to share with you the highly anticipated Scent Saver subscription program. So it's simple. We went originally, remember I told you uh, a while back that it was two pages of instructions to get them through this program. So we had to kind of reel it back and simplify it and we're going to be releasing this in phases. So I am excited to share with you phase one of our Scent Saver subscription program. All right, so just a disclaimer that I am on the test site right now, so you may see some products that aren't currently available, um, but that's because everything's loaded into the test site, but just wanted to let you know if you're seeing something that's not currently available. So here I am, I am on the homepage of our website. And so the only thing that you see different right now is right here, right? Scent Saver. So this has been added to the menu. And underneath Scent Saver, you'll find Introduction and Instructions. So if you say, hey, new customer, you go check out this program, just go simply go to my website under Introduction, you can learn more about it. And it'll take them to this landing page where it has a pretty image with the information about the sub subscribe and save. They select the fragrance, they select the frequency, and they can cancel any time, and they can change the fragrances as they wish, all right? And they'll save 20% on two 16-ounce candles, and then they also get to see how often they want it, from one to 13 weeks. So that shares that information, and then we're going to have a video. Right now, this is a placeholder, but we'll have an actual video for your customers that will be animated that kind of walks them through the program as well. And as soon as we have that available, we'll get that out to you. And then more information below, uh, surprise your senses, flat rate shipping, $9.95 on it, and then the subscribe and save here, where they can click for instructions. So they can either click here, and it takes them to the six simple steps, or under Scent Saver, it will take them to the same place. Okay, so now here we are, our step-by-step -step instructions for Scent Saver subscription. So step one, you have to log in um, as a customer. So if you don't have a customer account, they don't have an account, they just need to create one. So they can either do that by clicking on either one of these links or simply going to the login in the upper right-hand corner. And this is where it takes them. So if they're not a customer, they don't have an account yet, they can create their account by clicking on create your account, or they can simply sign in here. I already have an account and our customer's IDs are their, that's their email address. So I'm gonna use the account that I already have set up as a customer. So there we go, step one complete. How simple was that? So then the next thing you're gonna notice, I wanted to point out, look, now there's customer up here along the menu and it has edit profile, order history, manage addresses and manage subscriptions. So they can manage their whole account right under there. And then we've added a couple more drop downs under Scent Saver, create subscription, manage subscriptions and manage addresses. So either area here, they can get to the same information. So the next step, in this process, we need to go to manage addresses, okay? So why do we have to go here first? This is super important, guys, because you have to have the address set up in your address book that you want to ship the subscription to in order to finish the process, okay? And I'll show you a little bit what that means, but you have to have it set up first. So right now, I've got my mom's address in there, but I want, I want to ship one to myself, so I'm going to add my address into here. And I'm gonna nickname it, this is my home address. All right, there I am. So you can see I've entered this a couple times. So they would just enter a nickname for their address and then their address information. And then look how simple, save address, there it is. And then I confirm right here that my home address is in my address book. And the next step is, look at here, add new subscription. This is where I would create a new subscription. Click on this green button and voila. It takes me to our next step of filling out this simple one page form. So simple. So the first thing I'm gonna do is give my subscription a nickname, whether you know it can be whatever you want it to be. It could be Tony's birthday, you know, Abigail's anniversary, but mine is going to be a gift for me. Why not, right? Everyone likes to receive gifts, me included, so it's gonna be a gift for me. So that's the first thing as you select the nickname for your subscription. The next thing, super easy, you pick your two fragrances. So the two 16 ounce fragrances that you would like to be shipped to you. So I'm going to do hot apple pie and how about sweet orange and chili pepper, okay? So those are my two selections that I want sent out to me. 
the next thing I do is just select a start date. So when do I want these to start going out to me? Um, how about, let's see, how about the 23rd? 23rd sounds like a good date. So I've selected my date, then I need to select my frequency, okay? So I have the opportunity to go from one week to 13 weeks. So I think I'm just gonna go, how about somewhere in the middle? How about every eight weeks? I would like these two candles sent to me. And then there's also the option to do a gift message, which is up to 100 characters. So I'm just going to say, have a great day, right? Great day. You can write whatever, happy birthday, happy anniversary, and put who it's from, and that will be printed on their invoice so they know who the subscription is coming from. And now here's where that valuable step one was so important, right? Because it gives you a drop down of what addresses are in your address book. So if I hadn't added that, I would have had to start all over. So we don't want your customers to get frustrated and have to do that. So here's my address. I simply select that. The next step is payment. So they may already have a payment added or that they can select from or click here and they can add a new card. Super simple. So I am just going to select a card that I already have entered. And then guess what? Create subscription. Voila, done. Simple, simple. Really it's only five steps because number six is repeat steps one through five if you want to set up another subscription because you can set up as many subscriptions as you want, right? So you can set one up for yourself, friends, family, businesses, whatever you want to do. You can do whatever you want. You can use a different credit card, different address for each one of them. So super flexible and simple. So then you also will get a confirmation email. So the minute you heard, you may, maybe not heard my ding, but <laughs> I had a ding in my email saying that I have a confirmation email with all the information about the subscription that I just sent up. So that you'll be getting that. And then say you want to edit it, right? So say, hey, last month I had hot apple pie and sweet orange and chili pepper. And now, you know, I don't want the same ones. So you simply see where it took me to my current subscriptions, which again, you would find under manage subscriptions there or manage, manage subscriptions here under Scent Saver. But I'm going to click edit, okay? I'm going to go under here. It takes me right back to that easy one step form, right? And I'm going to select, oh, I'm going to do apple cinnamon now. And what else do I want? I will do, oh, I don't know more. Those sound good. And then also my next order date, I can change that if I want. You know what? I'm super excited about this, so I want to get it sooner. So I'm going to change that to the 16th. I'm still good with the eight weeks. That's good. But one thing I did want to mention to you guys, under this dropdown, remember, we're in a test server. But what you would see are all of our annual fragrances and our current fragrance of the month, meaning like we're in February right now that I'm doing this recording. So I would have the opportunity to select all of our annual fragrances, our January fragrance of the month, and our February fragrance of the month because they're both active, correct? So say my next shipment that is coming in March and I want to make sure I get that March fragrance of the month. I'm excited about it. You don't know what it is yet. I do, but you don't, but you're going to be excited about it. So I want to get that March fragrance of the month. I can go back here in March, after March 1st, and have the opportunity to select that current fragrance of the month. Okay, so that's how it will work all year round. So once I've made all those changes there, I just hit save, and then I can see here, see where it changed it here? And this is also where, remember we said they can cancel at any time? This is also where they can delete the subscription if they don't want it any longer. So super, super easy, you guys. Great way for your customers to save 20% on their favorite fragrance as often as they like. So this is coming soon. And as soon as we have the customer video, we'll get that out to you as well. So I hope you enjoyed this. And I hope you have a great day. Thanks, everybody.